Hey, how's everybody doing? Hey, Mark here again. Hey, I hope everyone's doing well. Thought I'd give a quick update on the uh, the new Viper Track table build. While I'm I'm still waiting for the track. Um, I was told it, it it is on the router, and it, or last week it was on the router, and it's, it's still in progress. A week later, as of today, um, which is Thursday. But I thought I'd show you a few things that I was thinking of doing for my driver station. Um, well, for one, I bought from Viper some of these universal holsters. And they, they fit pretty good. I mean, they kind of, you know, they drop right on, on there. And, you know, they hold the gun pretty good. And I like the black color. I think it goes pretty good with my other colors. So that's kind of going to be the holster. I bought two of them so far. I got to get two more. But I've been playing around with some options for my driver stations. And I bought these cheap shells. They actually were this gray color when I got them. Um, they were on sale on Amazon. I think I paid like, they were like 40-something 40, 40 percent off, I think. I paid less than $30 for four of these shelves. So, you know, they're wood, they're screwed together. They're, they're kind of a soft wood though. So I don't know how well these things are gonna hold up, but my thinking was, and they kind of have this slot. So for now, I'm thinking I'm just gonna do the two screws, slide that down, you know, in the slot. And that would be my driver station. and. If I ever need to take it off, I can just lift it up and kind of, if I make the wires long enough, put it under the table. Because I do have to deal with my attic door, which comes right down, like barely. <laughs> and then the ladder is like an inch away from, from where I want the track. I kind of want to keep the track far enough away from the wall over there so people can get, stand around it. So... If I ever have to take the driver station off, at least like to, to bring the attic ladder down, I can, I can take it off pretty quickly. Um, so yeah, we'll see how these things hold up. I don't know. They were cheap, so if they don't last, I'll think of something else. But this is also the the driver station that Viper sells with the resettable circuit breaker. I kind of you know put some holes in it and dug out a space big enough for the breaker to come out and I actually turned around. I took it apart and turned these top parts around so that you could actually take it off all the way. It doesn't stay on. So if I want to just go with the, you know, the bare uh, stud sticking up, I can. But if I also want to kind of just open it up and clip on on the side I could do that so so that's my thinking got a couple other things going on over here I got all different kinds of wire I'm gonna do for the positive I'm gonna do the color of the track so red uh, red blue yellow white and then I got black for negative these are my screws for mounting the table which doesn't want to open, but nothing special here. Just a box of screws. What are these? Uh, five eighths, number six screw that I'm going to use. It's Viper recommended. I did get the infrared light bridge, so that's pretty cool. This is a. Uh, Kind of neat, they have these little pointers on it, so I guess that lines up with the holes in the track, so you know you are you got the thing centered right, and it's an eight inch space between that. So by comparison, you could you could see how much bigger a Viper, four lane Viper track is than uh, an AFX track. So, and this is seems to be made out of the same material that they they make the track out of in the same material that the AFX, board, AFX borders I bought from them. So, nothing fancy, but it's, but it works, so. I also bought a bunch of terminals, spade terminals, 
all kinds of different uh, terminal block sizes. I can play around with uh, how I'm going to wire this track up. And yeah, that's it. Now I'm just anxiously waiting for the, the track to show up. So, But I think that's my plan for now. I'm going to go with those for the holster to hold your controllers. And these are this is going to be my my driver station, you know, spaced out evenly. I have to figure out the spacing and the mounting for this, but and it gives you a little bit of a shelf space. Put a few cars or whatever. Yeah, I think it'll work. And obviously, this is this one I painted. It's the same color as the border. So I have to paint the. I did. I painted this one as well. Still working on the hole for that one, but. Yeah, that's it. That's that's where we're at. And this is the table. I don't think you guys saw the table fully painted, so it's uh coming along pretty good. Just need the track now. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks. I hope everyone's doing well. Again, I appreciate you checking out the video, and we'll talk with you guys soon.